Today we're running to a Facebook Marketplace deal for Poly Pockets. We're paying 85 cash and we're going to be selling this lot for over a thousand dollars. So let's get straight into the video. Ever I found these are collectibles. Well, some of them are amazing. Here Thank you, go. and I hope you have fun with those. I will. Thank you so You're much. Right. Oh God. Yo yo yo! We're back with the Polly Pockets. We got a bunch of these Polly Pockets. I can't believe the amount we actually just obtained for $85. When I was seeing the picture, I actually didn't think it was this many. We've got a lot. These are just the compacts. We got like big ones right here. Fucking huge. We got the small ones right here. And they basically are almost all complete. All the little cars and the little figures. Oh. Shit, I'm losing them. So we got a bunch of the little houses. This one's awesome. Like a little uh, tree tree house, what would you call it? Tree house? This one's pretty cool. It's like a little crystal top. You can open it up. So, there's a lot of these. Okay, so look at this. We got this, it's like a little angel figure and it comes with like a little mushroom, pink, glittery, Little compact. There's even a little swing at the top. I don't know. Ones like this, I think, are actually just really cool. Little compact. And Bluebird 1992. We even have some small ones here. This one's like a little, little horse head or something. <laughs> we have a lot. This one's really cool. It's like a little bus. From, uh, what is this one from? 1994, this little purple bus. And now, I'm not sure if I'm going to lot these all up or if I'm going to sell them singly because a lot of them are complete. Like, we just, I just had one in my hand. Like, the one I just closed, that one was complete. This one's complete with both the little figures. This one has, like, a little slide. That's actually kind of cool. So, I'm just confused. I'm just not really sure if we're going to lot them all up. This one's 1989, so I was wrong. These are actually some 80s. This one's probably one of the only 80s. 1989 right there. I haven't looked at all of them, but... Oh, that one's 1989 as well. Okay. So there's a couple 80s in here as well. Some late 80s. So I haven't really decided what we're going to do with them. Because we have so many. I don't know if it's better that we sell them in a lot. Or if we sell them separately. Especially the ones that are complete. I'm not sure. We're going to figure it out. I'll come back and show you guys exactly what I do sell them for and update everybody but this is all the ones we did get 1990 on this one it's cool a little like a uh, flower yeah a lot of them are very unique and these big ones just like really open up got like the little wedding hall chapel church pretty cool just found this ps4 right out the thrift Pretty crazy. I'm hoping it works. I tested it. It was going blue and making noises. So I'm pretty sure it's good. I'm pretty sure it's just a dirty PS4. I actually have a controller at home too to lot up with this. So should be a quick sale. A little PS4 piece. I think this is the PS4 Slim too. I'm not even sure. 125A. Yeah, I'm not sure. I haven't really messed with PS4s too much actually. I'm more of an Xbox person. So. I don't remember this at all. <laughs> I don't think anybody remembers this. If you remember this commercial, drop it in the comments. I don't think anybody does. So we're back and I sold a bunch of the Polly Pockets already. I posted them last night at 1 a.m. It took me a while to just upload each one one by one, which I've done. Each one I singly listed one by one by one. And here they are. We'll start from the bottom on all prices. So we got one for 50, another one for 80, 40, 80, 
80, 40, 80, 40, 40, 50, 80, 70, 60, 80, 50, 40, 40. And we sold one already for 50, took an offer. It was posted for 60, took an offer for 50, and we sold the figures, the rest of the figures that didn't match with any of the sets for $101 plus shipping. So, oh, and we, we sold actually another bundle of three. Thanks for doing this because I bundled three up for them. And we sold three of these for $170. The money box, the tree, and this little... I don't know, it's called the Wishing Well, Fairy Wishing Well or something like that. So they were complete sets and they all came with the sets. So we took a little offer for $170 for the bundle of those. Already we made about $300. And yeah, we paid $85. So that was already a crazy, crazy deal and come up. And I'm going to get shipping those out soon. So those were the first three sales. I'm going to continue to show you guys what they sell for exactly and how much I really make at the end of this. So the end of this video will be the conclusion of how much I made on these. But we were at the thrift store today and we found these. And this is just a ridiculous, crazy find. These alone go for quite a bit of money. Grand Theft Auto, the double pack. The GTA double pack right here sells for like a lot of money two hundred dollars a hundred ninety one sixty this one's that one alone and it sold for a hundred dollars complete and we have these complete so this is a, just a crazy deal a crazy find i should say not a deal because i found them at the thrift store well it is a good deal and we have them both complete with the manuals and the maps in just mint condition like look at this just mint the corners have not been touched on both of these and the maps they haven't even been unfolded and look at the discs like this is a ps2 game just mint like a mirror you can see me perfect both of these it looks like someone didn't even play these games so just ridiculous finds at the thrift today and then we found of course one of the greatest games made for ps2 simpsons hit and run and this one was in great great condition as well complete yeah, you want to pop that back in there for me so it doesn't go flying around and i don't want to put this i'll be the one who puts the scratches on the disc messing around with them hit and run complete and this one as well like whoever had these donated them man they were just mint a complete adult owned game for sure no scratches no marks just mint look at the condition of the case even like if you were gonna have ps2 games uh graded these are the ones that you might want to try to buy to get graded because they're just mint like crisp corners no marks so this game alone goes for 60 to 80 dollars and i'm gonna go for a higher price because it is absolutely mint and then as you've seen these are going for about 100 and 120 to 200 realistically so i'll be around that price and then we found this dragon quest the big box not the little case, the big box. And look at this. The guy who owned this, he never opened it from the top. So it's completely sealed at the top. He only popped it from the bottom. So, like, you can tell whoever had this stuff was just, like, really caring about everything. He wasn't messing around with this stuff. And I'm surprised, actually, it even ended up in a thrift store. This stuff could be, you know, sold to a game store or even a pawn shop. But Mint Manual. And this one actually has a demo disc with Final Fantasy inside of it. And that's actually supposed to come inside. I didn't think it did, but it does. I never owned this game when I was a kid, but it comes with a demo disc in the big box and the art on the box and case just ridiculous. And again, the game, mint, mint disc, mint case. So this stuff is just like a collector's item at this point. And then we found this one, not in the best condition, a little bit worse. Than those ones but still in pretty good condition gta san andreas not worth that much but still complete with the the manual and the map and i'll take this one map out for you because i think someone actually unrolled this one already this one was probably the one of the greatest games ever made everyone probably played this game on the entire face of the earth at this point almost anybody who's at a gaming console at least but you know, the poster speaks for itself. What an OG poster. Pretty good condition. And it comes with a game, so 
All right, so I sold all the Poly Pockets except for like maybe two or three. I'm not even going to wait for those ones to sell. I'm just going to end the video right here. We made about this much off of all the Poly Pockets. An insane flip, an insane come up. If you ever see Poly Pockets, definitely don't pass them. Definitely get them, especially if they're the Bluebird ones. The newer ones are a little bit harder to sell. They take a little bit longer to sell, but the Bluebird ones are really good. So that's going to be the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, that like button, that sub button. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. Water, 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 water.